How not to catch a bugbear. Brought to you from the creators of the sepsis aware bears. The best way to prevent sepsis is to stop an infection happening in the first place. There are lots of things that we can do to prevent infections and we want to tell you how you can reduce your chance of getting an infection. The biggest way to prevent yourself from getting an infection is by making sure you have clean hands. It is important that your hands are clean before you touch your eyes, nose or mouth. Other times you should clean your hands or before you eat, after using the toilet or bathroom and whenever you can see your hands are dirty. When you wash your hands make sure you wet your hands first. Then put soap on your hands and make sure you wash them for 20 seconds or more if you can. Make sure you cover all parts of your hands including palms, tops of hands, in between fingers, your thumbs and your fingertips. Hand gel can be used when you can't wash your hands with water and if your hands look clean. Respiratory hygiene means making sure we don't spread our coughs and sneezes to people around us and we can do this by making sure we cover our nose and mouth when we cough or sneeze. The best way to do this is with a tissue that can be thrown away immediately after use. If you don't have a tissue you can always use your elbow to catch your sneeze or cough. What we're trying to do is make sure we don't use our hands. Whenever you blow your nose or cough, you should wash your hands afterwards. Keeping hydrated is another good way to help stop infections, particularly in our wee. We should drink at least eight cups of water a day. If you are told to drink less than eight cups of water a day, please ensure you drink the amount that is safe for you. We can stop infections in our wee by making sure we wipe front to back when we've been to the toilet and always wash our hands afterwards. Keeping hydrated will also help prevent pressure sores. A really good way to stop us getting infections is to have vaccinations. Vaccinations are treatments that we have through our life to prevent us catching some diseases. These are really important for children and pregnant women when travelling to some foreign countries and for seasonal illnesses like the flu. Vaccinations are given as a spray up the nose or sometimes as an injection. Vaccinations are safe and for the flu jab, family carers and paid support workers can have it for free as well. Oral hygiene is very important to prevent infections to our lungs. We can help prevent germs from staying in our mouth and going into our lungs by keeping our mouth clean. We can do this by drinking lots of water, cleaning our teeth twice a day and having someone help us if we can't do this ourselves. As you can see, there are lots of things you can do to prevent yourself from getting an infection and these things will also help prevent those around us from getting infections too. Preventing infections will help prevent sepsis. If you would like to know more about any of the information discussed in this video, please talk to your doctor, nurse or care worker. You can also find out more by searching for Sepsis Aware Bears on any social media platforms. Thank you for listening.